The Bell River Canadians hosted the Wheatley Sharks February 21st for Game 5 of the first round of the Great Lakes Junior C Hockey League playoffs. Coming off their first postseason loss in Game 4, the Canadians used their home ice advantage to secure a win against the Sharks and move on to the next round. The game began with a slow start until Bell River forward Jason Comeris netted the puck in the second half of the first period. The Habs successfully held off the Sharks, leaving the period with a score of 1-0. Wheatley's Trevor Grieve answered the Canadiens' goal in the second period, but Bell River was quick to gain the offensive edge with Brendan LaRock scoring the team's second goal. The third period began in favor of Wheatley, with Austin Fontaine evening the odds in the first 28 seconds. Bell River skaters Nick Dobrich and Weston Gall prevented the Sharks from gaining an advantage by both adding goals, leaving Wheatley with a deficit of two. It was kind of nice actually. Chauvin fed me a great pass. We played together all year last year and we just kind of have that connection together where uh, he just knows where I am and he made a no-look pass to me and, and I found it back of the net. Snuck one in. Pulling their goalie came out in favor of the Sharks after their extra attacker Curtis Olette netted a goal leaving them only one point behind. Bell River was able to hold off Wheatley's man advantage and get the Game 5 win, sending them to the next round of the playoffs while they were face the Moortown Flags February 26 at Bell River Lakeshore Arena. Head coach Mark Segan was pleased with the team's performance and is looking towards the next round of the playoffs. Oh, I'm very pleased with the game. Obviously, uh, you wrap up a four-game series against a very tough team and we didn't have our best effort Sunday, so for the boys to bounce back and finish it at home, uh, we're very satisfied. If we wouldn't have won tonight, it would have made for a long series. Uh, Moortown's a team that's very physical. They dump and chase the whole time. Um, to beat them, it's just going to take great D-zone coverage, and uh, we got to forecheck, forecheck the hell out of them. Well, we're going to have to put a plan together. They're a very offensively gifted team. they got the MVP of the league. Uh, uh, they got one line that's very potent. Uh, right off the bat, we're going to have to keep it five on five, because if we uh, take the penalties we did in this series against Moortown, they'll fill the net. So. Uh, especially we're going to have to play five on five. For Mediaplex News Now, I'm Joseph Elliott.